Matthew 24, 14. And this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for a witness unto all nations, and then shall the end come. The next verse is Matthew 4, 23. And Jesus went about all Galilee, teaching in their synagogues and preaching the gospel of the king, kingdom and healing all manner of sickness and all manner of disease among the people. The next verse is Romans 10, 17. So then faith cometh by, hear, by hearing and hearing by the word of God. But I say, verily, have they not heard? Yes, verily, their sound went to all the earth and their words unto the ends of the world. And the final one is Colossians 1, 6 and 23. Colossians 1, verse 6. Which is come unto you, as it is in all the world, and bringeth forth fruit, as it does also in you, since the day ye heard of it, and knew the grace of God in truth. And then Colossians one twenty three says, If ye continue in the faith, grounded and settled, and be not moved away from the hope of the gospel, which ye have heard, and which was preached to every creature which is in heaven, wherefore Paul and made a minister. If you continue in the faith grounded and settled, and be not moved away from the hope of the gospel which you have heard, and which is preached to every creature which is under heaven, wherefore I, Paul, am now made a minister. Now we're going to say a short prayer. Dear Lord, thank you for everything that you do for us. Please continue to forgive us for thoughts and words and deeds that were wrong. Please continue to guide us in the right direction. As this verse states, allow us to continue with our faith. Keep it grounded and settled, regardless of the deception and the tribulations and everything around us. Allow us to stay faithful always in you. Allow us not to move away from the hope of the gospel. Because sometimes we may feel that hope is all we have, but we know you are there. You know, we know you're protecting us. And again, we know it's not always going to be easy. So Heavenly Father, watch over us. Protect us. Remind us of the faith and the hope that's within us that you provided for us. Thank you for being ever-present and ever there. Love you with all our heart, souls, minds, and bodies. In the name we pray. Amen.